guys, I'm driving Leroy Jr. right now, and I'm about to go call out Cletus a race from a dig, me and Leroy Jr. and him in the Carbon Cub. Hey, dude, I'm calling you out right now. Leroy Jr. versus the Carbon Cub from a dig. I'm ready, dude. You ready? You think you got it? I don't think I got it. I mean, you got that bigger <laughs> prop on that there. So, that thing is fast. <laughs> it is fast. But I'm willing to do it. I've kind of always wanted to do that. Right? Okay, so guys, Leroy Jr. is being given away tonight, Friday at midnight. Every $5 you spend on CletusMcFarland.com gets you one entry to win this car. It is a Whipple Supercharged Texas Speed 4L65 by RPM Transmissions. This is like their baddest to the bone, four-speed transmission in the car, and it absolutely rips. They did a nine-second pass at Bradenton last night, so she's fast. George, any predictions here? I'm pretty sure Leroy's got this one. <laughs> Which one? I guess it depends on the distance. Which one can do a bigger burnout? You know, with the smoke on the cub and laying oh, it down in Leroy Jr. Oh, well, probably the cub. It is a lot of smoke. It is a lot but, of smoke. You know, the cub don't get caught in traffic. <laughs> That's what you do. Fly right over it. They both have the same air conditioning system. They both make good power to wait. Well, it's not so. any big burnouts in all Leroy Jr. <laughs> That's the first time I've ever heard him say something like that. That's kind of crazy. It's, it's almost not ours at this point. It's no one. if you call that a street race but it was a race I think we need to give him a couple cub lengths on this one He's, he said it's, it's way too windy oh dude he's just floating there it might as well be a helicopter now dude that is so awesome <laughs> that thing is awesome man he's a pilot I'll tell you what so what do you think about Leroy Jr., oh, bud? That's a real run what you brung race right there. <laughs> Boat, plane, train, whatever you got, we'll run it. I don't care, we're racing. <laughs> we're racing. I really want to keep it. That's pretty sweet, man. It's so cool. I mean, the aerial atom is awesome, don't get me wrong, but I, I'm just a little more into drag racing than I am road course racing. Okay, but here's the deal. If a road course guy wins or gal wins, uh -huh. they're probably going to pick the atom, right? Yeah. But a majority of our of the fans are drag racers, so most likely Leroy Jr. is going to get picked. But if he doesn't, I think everyone at the shop will be pretty happy. She's <laughs> getting turned up if you don't buy. She's getting turned this up. will not be the last engine that goes in here. No, this stays this, around this yeah, shop. This is this is the baseline, you know. You know what's cool about this is the pulley goes all the way to the back, right? It doesn't have a direct drive into one of the rotors. Yeah, yeah. So Correct. there's a yeah. shaft that runs all the way across the back. And Your it's jack shaft never go out. Is this the smallest jack, pulley? No, no okay. that's the largest pulley. Okay. We heard you were driving, so we had to put the bigger pulley back on. <laughs> bigger pulley, less power, it doesn't spin as many RPM. Smaller pulley, you get more RPM out of the blower, making more boost. So people talk about bigger, smaller pulleys, they're talking about this one right here. And right now is the biggest one on, so that's kind of a manageable power for whoever's driving it. It's actually the, it's the same one that was on for the dyno. Well, I'm just telling you, see. So okay, so it's, when it made how much power? Six hundred and seven forty torque or seven twenty torque. That's a lot. It's a lot. Have y'all ever experienced seven hundred, six hundred horsepower? Yeah. Six hundred horsepower and seven hundred foot pounds of torque on the street. I mean, you are pushing your limits. So nine second car on the strip, 
it's a it's gonna be a beaut for someone to take home that's for sure every five dollars you spend you can get the kids carpet a toothbrush an alice george shirt a tie shirt a parker sticker whatever you want gets you one entry to win leroy jr or the ariel adam this thing's a bad unit they both are they're they're gonna be really fun cars for whoever wins it so good luck go get you an entry now this is a once in a lifetime opportunity all right we're winging it all right guys we're taking off reducing some instrument time today. 0.7 hours left before my check ride. We got Pierce and he's my CFI. I'm gonna put the hood on, it looks kind of stupid, but it's simulating like we're stuck in the clouds, so let's let's rip. We got our checklist done. You ready? I'm ready to go. Venice traffic, Piper 32769 are taking off runway 23 and departing to the north. Venice. <sighs> yourself in a situation where you've been wrenching on your car need a 10 millimeter wrench plowing a bag of flaming hot cheetos and drinking a dr pepper and realize dang it i really need to brush my teeth well now's your chance i'm talking dr parker 10 millimeter tool brush a toothbrush on one end a 10 millimeter wrench on the other this sucker cnc billet aluminum baby lifetime warranty get them now at cletusmcfarland.com 